It was hot and muggy in the city, so we decided to load up with Stedman's and head to Wayne County. I'm Adam Equal, and thanks for tuning in with Kurt Stedman here. And uh, we're just off the Paiute Trail. Um, pretty popular ATV system in Utah. Yeah, it's probably one of the most popular trail systems in Utah. Yeah, a lot of people ride it, I know that. I mean, all over the country. Yeah, we're always getting asked for information and maps on the Paiute Trail. Yeah. So we're gonna introduce you to some residents here from Wayne County who have spearheaded an effort to add an additional 200 miles of trail to the Paiute ATV trail system here on the Parker Range. We're gonna go explore, maybe wet a line. Yeah, that sounds fun. We're sitting in the Parker Mountain right now. It's a new trail system that the Paiute Trail Committee, we put together and uh, GPSed all this area. Uh, we've been working on it seven and a half years to get to this point. It all started when you look at our map, we had a big hole in our map and I said, wait a minute, that's Parker Mountain. Why don't we have the road shown in Parker Mountain? because you couldn't buy a map of this area. And so we just started putting it together. I had to do some selling and that stuff, and it took a little arm twisting. And, uh, and this is uh, what we call phase one. It's just over 200 miles. It's totally side-by-side -side trail system. Parker Mountain, once we get done, it connects the Paiute Trail into Marysville and Circleville. Also takes you up on the Dutton. You got Bryce Canyon, you got Penguin Lake. Also, Penguin Lake takes you up to Yankee Meadows into Parowan. So, it's just an interconnecting the whole state, is what I'm trying to get through. The new Parker Mountain Trail takes the Paiute Trail system up to 1,679 miles of OHV trails in Utah. We've got a little bit of everything. For, I mean, we've you know got valleys, hit mountains. Uh, we just came up to 10,000 feet almost here. Yeah. We have two 12,000 foot peaks. We've got canyons, uh, hunting, fishing, hiking, biking, ATVing. We've got something for everybody. This new 200 miles goes right by some pretty good fishing. You'll find fish in Roll Lakes and a couple of others nearby that hold grayling and brook trout. From there, you can ride or hike on hundreds of miles of spurs, roads, and trails that aren't part of the Paiute Trail system, but you'll find tons of fishing and wildlife around every corner. We want you to enjoy the ride, look at the antelope. He's a good little buck. He doesn't like us coming over here, though. I mean, you can catch a lot of antelope out here. You can catch the deer, you can catch the elk. I want to bring the people in to see what we got to generate business into Wayne County, Garfield County, into the Paiute County, because tourism is our bread and butter. I think it's going to be great. Wayne County loves to see people come and enjoy our trail system. It's great for the businesses here and for our county, and we love to share our, our beautiful mountains and area here. By adding this to our system and numbering it, it's going to make it easier for people to get around. If you don't know exactly where you're going, you can get a map now and make your way to these places that you might otherwise might not be able to access. And this is all open to all width machines. We've kind of gotten a bad rap for being only 50 inch trail system and we're far from that. We've got uh, something for every size machine up to full size vehicles. The best way to explore this area is to get a map, something you can find by going to PaiuteTrails.com. It's the most current mapping of the whole Paiute Trail system. They also have plans of a kiosk with maps, picnic tables, camping sites, and restrooms for this new section of the trail. That's what we're after, and it's just one day at a time. Riding the new Parker Mountain Trail system, there's endless possibilities in Wayne County. But when you do go, make sure you stop by the Anamone Merc. They have the best burger and homemade pies in all of Utah. Dude, that thing's huge. <laughs> and if you're looking for a place to stay, you'll find some cool spots like the Road Creek Inn in Loa.